can see the towers and the gateways. As this is the side wall and the castle is on the opposite side, when we come down to the end of this road here, you've got the harbour and the river. Conway, <laughs> it involves the drivers having to negotiate these fabulous medieval arches that weren't built for massive big modern coaches. <laughs> Look how close we are. Evan, can you get a little closer? He's thinking I have No, he does. Well, maybe. Yep. He is so brave. See if we can get over there and then. <laughs> Look at that. It looks like he's holding the. Put your thumb down a little bit. There you go. <laughs> oh, it looks like he's holding this, the seagull. <laughs> I love you. Should I sing for you? <laughs> a little more to the right. My right. Your hand. My. Your hand. My right. Your left. Your left more. Your left more. Up. Oh. Yeah. Hey, buddy. You're so cool. Thanks for letting me hang out with you. How's it going? Finding any dingle hoppers lately? I would totally feed you if I had food, I promise you. Yeah, I don't got nothing, sorry. <laughs> Good morning! Today we are at Conway Castle. It is day 12 of our vacation, and this castle is really cool. There's lots of uh, towers and stuff behind us, the ruins. And how old is this place? 13th century. 13th century is when it was built, and they were saying it was built in four years. Yep. This whole thing was built in four years. That's what they said. A little bit quick. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. Um, so we've been exploring a little bit here, and then we're going to go down and get a snack and coffee, maybe, um, before we have to get on the bus, and we'll go into town. Mm -hmm. I like the color of those flags, the purple and yellow, because it reminds me of Tangled. Yeah. Unfortunately, it's raining, <laughs> but that's okay. Time to get back on the bus. But we just saw a breed of dog 
that is a mixture of a Bedlington Terrier, which is a little lamb dog with the white curly fur on their nose, and a Whippet. And it kind of looks like a, basically a Whippet with long hair, long wiry hair. the chocoholic which is chocolate ice cream with chocolate chips inside You look like you might live here. Yeah, but we haven't seen anybody dressed like this. <laughs> I'm just saying you blend in well to Liverpool. Uh Castle. It was a nice 12th century castle. One out of the hundred we've been to, it's probably the best. Yeah, it was it was fun to walk around. My favorite part of the castle, the castle was cool, mm -hmm. but the birds, <laughs> the birds <laughs> at the castle. So I saw a white pigeon, mm -hmm. which was really cool. I got a little footage of that. He was really pretty. And then I saw a pink pigeon. I got some footage of him, but male pigeon struck. my all-time favorite was finding Scuttle and getting to talk to Scuttle. <laughs> there was a seagull that let us just walk right up to it and hang out with him for a little bit. So that was fun. They were very friendly. It wasn't the top of the tower? Well, the views were really cool. Yeah, the views were awesome. But I have to say, I'm my favorite were the birds. <laughs> getting to hang out with the birds. And then we walked around... Betsy Coed, probably pronounced a little differently. It. it was a little area, like a shopping center area called Betsy Coed. That's where we had our lunch today. And we got to meet a couple, a couple of couples from Canada. And we chatted with them for a little bit. It was really fun to meet people from Canada. Cause I've never been to Canada, but Evan has, but they were very friendly. And so we did that. And then we walked around their cute little town and got some ice cream and we saw a ton of dogs. There are dogs everywhere. Not like stray dogs, but like people bring their dogs everywhere with them here. And I love it in Wales. We need to move to Wales so we can take our dogs everywhere we want to go. Because they were like, I'm not talking like we saw two or three. We saw like 20 dogs within the less than an hour that we were in that small little area. Yeah. Just everyone just brings their dogs. And, you know, I got to see some really cool dog breeds today. Ones that we don't see in America, which is cool. If you can't tell, I love animals. <laughs> <laughs> They're like the highlight of my days. And then we came back to Liverpool and we just did one little thing in Liverpool. We saw the little Beatles statue. But overall, yeah, we had a great day. The only thing I did not like, the only thing, was the two 
our bus ride back. So we took the scenic route back from Betsy Coed back to Liverpool. But we got to see lots of little baby lambs at, along the ride and the countryside was beautiful. It just was a long bus ride to be on for two hours. Tomorrow we are not docking in Dublin. Turns out we are docking in the port for Dublin. We have to figure out a way to get to Dublin. Hopefully they have some sort of shuttle bus or something to take us there. Because finding transportation has been a challenge for us this trip. So we're gonna say goodnight Night. on day 12 of our trip. Tomorrow will be day 13. Lucky 13. We've got six days left. Six days left of our vacation. And it doesn't feel like we've been gone that long, but mm -mm. anyways. All right, it's the end of day 12. Good night. Night.